What's up, Jigs or Peace? And today we will bring you another episode of our Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Let's play walkthrough. And before we get started, if you wouldn't mind just tapping that like button down below because your support really does mean the world. And if you're new here, then hitting that subscribe button because we've got a bunch of Scarlet and Violet content coming your way. Now, we are looking today to we bring up the map to hit both the second gym or our second gym. You can do them in any order. And the Starfall Street Fire Crew Base. Um, we probably will end up exploring all of this as well. Because my brain can't help but go and run around everywhere when I'm, I'm doing that. So, yeah. <sighs> Let's give you guys a... Oh, what? we was on the right screen. We was on the right screen, Jamie. We was on the right screen. Why's my buttons not working? Thank you. Okay, next update. We have caught 78 po types of Pokemon and battled 96 types. We have new on the decks. Cricketoon. Or oh, Cricketop. Combi. Jigglypuff. Tandemos. Smoliv. Rockruff. Starly, we saw Staravia, Oricorio, and Mareep. Seen a Shroomish, caught a Spoink. Bampy, saw Gibble. Knackly, there it is. Drifloon. Mankey, Meditite. Tadbulb. Mastchief. Seen a Teddy Ursa, caught a Swablu. Capsa Kid and Scyther. Hang on, did I see? Why did I think I saw Ditto then? Flittle, Mudbray, and Tinker Tink were all caught. And that's our Pokedex. Let's see what this Battle Pass thing is about because we have not touched this. So we got Stardust. We got Great Balls. I call it a Battle Pass, but it's like a Battle Pass for your Pokedex. We got a Thunderstone. And we got Ultra Balls. Candies. Firestone. Netball. Oh, and just shy to the water stone. Alright. Let's get into this. We're gonna explore the town first, then go and try and take on the gym. Alright. We're in the gym building for gym number two. There's Nimona ready for you. Ah! Via Jigsaw! It's so wild that we ended up randomly visiting the same gym at the same time again! What a weird coincidence! I swear I'm not just sneaking ahead of you so I can lie and wait and... Oh well, weird. Might as well battle now while we're here! No, seriously, look to prove it, I won't even challenge you to a battle this time, much as I'd like to. But look at you and your Pokemon, they've definitely gotten stronger since last time. Add these to the mix and you'll be 100% set to go, no problem. I'll be cheering for you, I'll go train like maybe 20 Pokemon or so while you tackle the gym. 20 Pokemon? Welcome to the Artisan Gym. Let me register you as a challenger. Your name is Jigsaw, yes? Great. Now, in order to face the gym leader, Bra Brassius, you will first need to pass the gym test. Here at the Artisan Gym, that means completing a game of Sunflora Hide and Seek. As you may know, Artisan is the city of artists. The artwork made by the people here is largely inspired by nature and the sun that nurtures it. Since Sunflora embody these concepts, We'll try to gather them and take good care of them. Your job today is to find the Sunflora located throughout Artisan. Remember those Pokemon look like sun-shaped flowers. Gather up to gather up ten of them and bring them to the Sunflora lawn. And you'll pass the test. I'll register the Sunflora lawn's location in your map app to get you started. When you leave the gym, turn right and you'll see two large Sunflora statues. Head for those. Once you're at the lawn's entrance, the staff here, staffer, 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 
There we'll tell you more about the gym test. Now get out there and have fun. Talk to me. Hi there. I look after the Artisone Gym Sunfloor. I hope you're ready, Challenger. It's time for a game of Sunfloor Hide and Seek. I'll go ahead and ask the Sunfloor to spread themselves out around town. Oh boy. Oh boy. Sunfloor is like the Sunfloor you... What? With that, your gym test has now begun. Once you've found 10 Sunfloor, please bring them back here to the Sunfloor lawn. That's all from me. Good luck out there. Right. Well, you didn't go very far, did you? <laughs> There's like three right here. Okay. That was weird. I got a feeling there would be one. Oh, you're in my way. There's one. Okay. <laughs> Look at them. <laughs> oh, man. I saw the uh, I am. I had to grab it. Uh, this is uh, this is wild. This. All right, let's go check out by the pool. There's one. He's at the vending machine. He's getting a can of salty pop. I think one just fell in the drink. <laughs> All right, we got five. We got six. Although I only see four. I think the other one fell in the water. Oh no, no, they got caught behind the vending machine. Okay. Uh, there's another one getting some food. <laughs> there's seven. Oh, it looks just like the trailer. Frame rate issues and all. There's eight. Uh. Okay. Nine. Hi, oh, run away. Gotcha. Wait, he wants the bell? Can I catch him? No, I can't. I don't even have the option for a ball. God damn it. Did that one do so much less? Uh, little girl, you're right there. <laughs> oh, she vanished. Gather ten sunflower in total. Make sure to bring them to the sunflower lawn. Coming in, guys. Yeah. Oh, I nearly went there wrong. I thought it was. I oh, no, no. know. 
for here. Have fun. Well done on finding all these sunflorists. You passed the gym test with flying colors. Now, please head back to the lobby at the Ar Artisan Gym to report your result. It seems you successfully gathered 10 sunflora and brought them over to the sunflora lawn. That means you cleared the gym test. Congratulations! You now earned the right to challenge the gym leader. Best of luck! Ooh. Are you ready to challenge gym leader Bracius? The Verdant Virtuoso? Sure, Verdant Virtuoso. Virtuoso. Very well, allow me to show you to the battle court. Verdant Virtuoso. When you're ready, then. Okay. When you're ready, you take your time. It's all right. Um, but greetings, challenger. Hmm. Superhero landing. You did well to come this far. I'm Bracius, an artist specializing in grass type Pokemon. I'm also the gym leader here at the Artisan Gym. Was in your gym test from atop the windmill, you know. Sorry, it's early morning. The perception you displayed in finding some flora was truly... Uh, how should we describe it? Yes, it was truly avant-garde. I only pray that you might demonstrate that eye of the beauty in our battle as well. Enough talk. We must begin creating our collaborative work of art. Trust that you are ready. It is time for our masterpiece to take shape. Challenge by Gym Leader Brassius. Alright, Verdant Virtuoso. A petty lil 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 lil. Art is creation and destruction. Struggle. I wish your defeat will nourish my Pokemon. That was a bit sadistic, I won't lie to you. Sleep powder miss? Yes! I got something in my eye. Oh, I need another miss. I need another miss. Ah! Damn it. Uh. The problem is he outspeeds me. So I don't think it's worth going for an awakening because I use an awakening this time, he uses sleep out next time. Ah! That hurt! <gasps> oh! So close. Alright, I'm much shocked because it guaranteed knockout, right? Oh, no, it doesn't. I'm an idiot. But my shot will lower his speed, so we might have a chance. I don't think it would have anyway. Alright, lower speed. Poison tail. We're slower. Fuck. I wish Nimble had a bug, bug time. I think we're going to just go Crocolore and sweep from there, I think. It's probably the most advantageous we can be. Uh, incinerate. These textures are so good. Like, Crocolore look... Crocolore? That's a different Pokemon. Crocolore looks fantastic. Hey, little small of. Bye, little small of. Oh, 
I might actually terrestrialize. This has promise, yes. Let us lead this artistic endeavor to the conclusion at once. Look at sort of water, he looks never looked so good. Alright. Throw a lump of crystal at his head. The egg's got a face now. The little egg has got he's got the little head now. Face on. Allow me to touch this work up stacking. I will call it a truly woodoo. Bruh. <laughs> Need a bad name. Okay, he gets music, I don't. Sudo Woodo achieves his dream. It wasn't his dream anyway, he was just disguising himself. He lived? Oh, sturdy. At times, art becomes a raging race against the clock. Let's increase the pace. Trailblazer. That done nothing. But he did get a speed increase. I don't know if the gym leaders heal. I'm going to incinerate it. They don't. Homo goes to level 22. Calm down, mate. Avant Guard! You an itchy head? He's got fleas. Ah, oh, what artistic tactics you employ. The patterns of your moves, the minute details of your Pokemon's performance, everything you did was owned to perfection. That battle was, in were a word, art. Indeed, if we could not call that a work of artistry, then nothing in this world could be labelled as such. If I were to judge your work, I would say it passed my expectations. Yes, a pass without exception. As proof of your artistic prowess. You may have my gym badge. Shall we take a photo as well? Anyway. <laughs> If you possess two gym badges, it would be easier to catch Pokemon up to level 30. And those Pokemon should follow your commands as well. To a fantastic trainer such as yourself, I would also like to offer this a favor to mine. Trail blazing. Or 20. Whoop whoop. <laughs> ah, my inspiration is overflowing as, I, as if drawn from a bottomless well. I will begin on a new piece at once. You must excuse me. Farewell. Dope and difficult. Dope and difficult. Dope and difficult. Pardon me, would you be the jigsaw I've been hearing so much about? Oh, he's one of the teachers. The man who had mentioned there was a promise in New Face of the Academy. Yes, indeed. Uh, but I do apologize. I didn't mean to startle you by addressing you so suddenly. My name is Hazel. I'm one of the Elite Four of Pokemon League. I also teach art class at the Academy. So do tell me, young Jigsaw, what compels you to collect these gym badges and strive to be a champion? The game? Uh, for fun, I guess. Austin answered, thank you. Naturally, there is no single correct answer. All paths lead to the great crater of Pal Paldea, as they say. You know, your friend Nimona is the youngest to achieve champion rank in Paldea in history. It's entirely possible that such great potential lies within you as well. He walks funny. You need a poop? Should you continue striving to reach champion rank, you will one day have to battle me. It would be wise to train hard starting now. It will save you from experiencing the bitter regret of defeat. Oh, and do come along to my art class sometime. It would be free to have you attend. Cocky bastard!
Oh, Nimble is evolving! Yo! Yo! Yo, he looks crazy. Lockix. Actually looks crazy. Oh my god. Oh, look at that run! Oh! Oh, Skip Loom's evolving. Oh, he's been on our team since pretty much day dot. And now he's a lovely little jump bluff. Would you look at that? Would you look at that? Oh, that's looking so good. What? Pomo is evolving? <laughs> Looks the same. Pomo! <laughs> Look at that. Oh, this shelf is looking so good, man. Oh, Wiggler is evolving! <laughs> Wog Trio! <laughs> Brilliant. Look at that. He goes, well, I don't know why he goes pink, but it's kind of cool. I like it. Gimme go! Gimme go! Gimme ghoul! Gimme ghoul! Come say hi, come say hi! Yeah, you came, so wanna battle? Aww, you little cutie! And my eye. And my eye of a student. Oh, this is gonna be a good experience. Oh, yeah. Uh, poison tail. Ah, that's gonna be bad. Hopefully, we get the poison. Or not. Just don't defense go again, and we'll be fine. Yeah, this should be decent experience, right? I know Chansey, Blissies, they give a good experience, so. Went nimble went up to level 20. You battle really good. Oh, she's so cute. She's so cute. Fun. I'm doing the treasure hunt too, and no fresh faced kid is gonna beat me. Beat you to what, you lunatic? Christina, the student. Ooh. Um, I can't really stay in against this thing as much as I'd love to because I don't really touch it. Um, 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 it's kind of nimble. Payback for what? I didn't do anything. Assurance! What? Soon as soon as about to send out Murkrow, will you switch? Oh, fuck's sake. Yes, I'll switch. Let's go back out to Whooper. Poison tail. Ah, oh, pick. Ah, oh, pick. Flip. Poison point. We love it. We love it. Oh, that's a 
Nice little two shot there. Oh, astonishing. Astonishing. Okay, cool. Look at us. Look at us. If that's how you battle, I'm sure you'll be able to find your treasure. I don't know what my treasure is. Hey, guess. Hey, guess who my favorite teacher at the academy is? A chalk. Chalk. Nora the Explorer. Love this actually has scales. Oh my god, incredible. In fucking incredible. Wish. First turn wish. Don't like that. Get poison. Damn it. It's fine. As long as we knock him out this turn, he doesn't get the wish anyway. Bye! Bye bye! Look at that. Procolore. Level 25. God damn. It's Mr. Jacques. I guessed it. Well, for now. Now let's battle. Rayon. Ryan. Ryan. Diglete, diglete, true, true. Diglete, diglete, true. Uh, this is no an ideal matchup. Um, let's kind of wiggle it. <gasps> Diglett versus wiggle it. Let's go. <laughs> Luxio? Oh god. Oh god. That's actually quite kinda of, kinda of scary actually. Wait a minute. Whooper whoopers here. Have no fear. It's not fun. Much shot. You can charge all you like. I'm going to crit and we're going to be done. Oh my god, I actually crit. What the hell? <laughs> That's two for two for today. We guessed Jock and we guessed the crit. Let's go. Let's go. I lost for now. <gasps> my Poopa Whoopa! He's evolving. Look at him. He's amazing. Claude Zaya! He's great! Love him. Hikers are super popular! I heard that I'd be super popular if I became a hiker. Chasing that popularity, Marina? <gasps> Toad's cool? We haven't seen him yet. Ooh. There's Echo Voice. That was a crit. Ooh, that's not good. Uh, uh. That done about the same as the crit because I've seen it stacks. He crit me, my goodness. I think we'll, we can live one more, uh, whatever he's using. Just trying to rack up this damage on him. Oh, he went for Stun Sport. And missed, we can go again. 
Oh, so close. Um. Oh, yeah. Hold on, Tanned Mouse. Tanned Mouse. Look at that. 241. Nice. Biking up the mountain of popularity. We go, we get a rocket with this music. We have a fire type rock rough. That's shiny. That's shiny. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> uh, sorry, buddy. Sorry, buddy. This is oh, so epic. Legit, so epic, this. Incredible. Actually incredible. Hey, did I just catch you littering? I need to battle you to protect the beach. I didn't litter, I don't know. Come on, dude. Sophia the waitress. Oh, an indeedy. Okay. That's something different. Let's spark him. This is a, a problem, actually. With psychic. We're fighting type. Fully para. Fully para. Fully para. Fully para. Fully para. No, uncalled me. Okay, you're an idiot. You an idiot. Big XP gains for everyone. Uh, Azumarill, keep gathering Pokemon in. Hi, Azumarill. Looking good as ever. Two shot. We'll take those. We take those. We take those. We take those. Full health. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Shell Belt doing it. Oh, my God. <laughs> Wait, she has three Pokemon. Jesus Christ. Okay. Everyone gaining levels. Wiggly wants to learn headbutt. Is headbutt better than slam? Less base power, but more accurate. Uh, gulping. Let's try someone else for gulping. Um. Actually, <laughs> actually, I don't really have anything else for. Uh, let's use Tandem Mouse. Where did they pick up the Pokey Doll? Where? Alright, uh, I think we stack Echoed Hits. It gets more powerful the more you use it. Oh, 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 oh. Don't power, thank you. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. no power, thank you. Is it enough? Oh, live. That's my own fault, I'm an idiot. That's my own fault, I am an idiot. You know what, we're gonna send out Nimble. Because why the heck was not? He finally got a bug type move, so...
Boom. Boom. Sorry about that. Seems like I was mistaken. Yeah, you were. Rude, to be honest. I need your help. I need a real workout. Sorry, Professor Sada is the one for me. <gasps> she got snow! Look how glistening the ice is! Wow, that's so cool. Oops. Souls. Now that was a good workout. I am sweating a ton. Monsters! I love Pokemon that are like the monsters in movies. You look like a monster in a movie. Ivan. <gasps> Here's a bag on. Let's get it on, bag on. I'm gonna arm thrust him. Sometimes can arm frost here. It can hit up to five, right? Legit would have bodied him in one if that had been the case. No para, thank you. One more. Yeah. Has he got more Pokemon? Oh, no, we just was going through an incredibly amount of screens. I can't believe my monster was defeated. You think Bagon looks like a monster? Rah rah! Do you want to see my super cool Pokemon figure eaten? You're channeled by Frederick the Pokemaniac. Oh, he's a Dano! That's cool. Come on, I'm frosted to oblivion, but that's cool. Let's go. That was easy peasy lemon squeezy. Ah, oh, crash, I lost. You did. She was so strong. A super strong girl asked me to bow. I lost before I could even blink. Is it Nimona? And Tony. As a monkey. And Tony and his monkey. I said it's Antony and his monkey. I'm gonna spark him. Am I? Or am I gonna arm thrust him? Now let's spark him. You mean like that? And now I lost to you too! You did. It doesn't matter. Nothing really matters. Me. It doesn't matter how old you are if Pokemon are strong. She's valid, to be fair. A liar. Got a rolls. Um, I thought you said it doesn't matter how they are as long as your Pokemon are strong. I'm just sent out a rolls, my dude. Volt absorb rolls at that. Now it's fine. We can buy it. It's neutral. It's yeah. Yeah. You just got just the one. You're strong and young. I'm a worker! I'm a worker, if you need work done, I'm your man! No wind, no shine, no rain, no snow stops me from getting the work done! I'm Marius, the worker! And a Voltorb! Alright, we ain't seen a Voltorb yet! That's 
kind of cool. Um, do I, I think I double hit. Roll it. Roll it. Okay, you got more than one more, though. No, I saw that. I saw that. Ooh, levels all round, baby. Levels all round. Play rough? Hell yes. Hell yes. Goodbye, Tower. Magnimite. Uh, I will switch, just because I don't really have anything for a Magnimite. Um, oh, why don't you have a fire type move? I'm gonna have to use Crocolaw. There's no way around here, boys. I love Crocolaw. I think he's great. Easy dub. Magnemite looks fantastic in this game. Oh, that's it. Look at Smolith. And in all the levels. What's the lone Razor Leaf? Hell yeah, boy! Hell yeah, boy! It's a very sweet scent. We don't need that. We don't need that. Beat Marius the Worker. We did indeed. Pokemon battles aren't work. I agree. Oh, our little mousies are evolving. Oh, they got big mouse. We got a family of mousies. <laughs> Mouse hold. <laughs> what a name. That's a brilliant name. Mouse hold. <laughs> Don't worry, I got it. What you got? Yeah, I'll take care of this, miss. I'll clean you out. What? Richard the Janitor. Oh, I see. I'll clean you out. Okay. I see. I see. I see. Alright, let's go for the water pulse. Ah. Don't disable that shit then. Oh, so close to the knockout. Bop. You cleaned me out. I did. Your bill. No, I'm not. I'm Jamie. I'm Jamie Jigsaw. If you lose to me, your bill will be one million dollars! Yeah? Alright, Isabel the Waitress, you trying to earn your living, are you? Say Alright. Uh, Cloud9, whatever. Uh, I'm a low kick. It's a two shot. It's gonna hurt. Okay, we, we're alright, we're alright, we're alright. Well, I got the math wrong. Enjoying your day off. Cause I am. Good for you, bro. Salvador the janitor. As a marini. Ooh. Ooh. How interesting. How interesting. Okay. Um, 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 Decent, actually. Oh, there's the crit. We love to see it. We love to see it. Uh, 
Oh, we're done. Okay. Goodness, you're strong. I can't actually see what it is. Oh, it's a flat baby. Is that grass type for baby? All the flowers. Oh, I went out to him thinking this was going to be like level 40 or something. Squawker Billy? Don't be silly. What powers are flying taxis? Squawker Billy's plucky spirit. Cabby Pablo. Who is Squawker Billy? I should be able to cross chop quite effectively, actually. Why did that do so much damage? Nice. What spirit? I love it! Sunflora! Sunflora flood the floral fiefdom in formation. Sunflora flood the floral fiefdom in formation. I made my own tongue twister. Alright then, buddy. Felix. Alright then. You might be losing your mind a little bit out of here. Maybe you go back to school, eh? No, we missed! <laughs> Just more annoying. More of a nuisance than anything. If I do something about that. Oh, it doesn't even knock him out. Ow. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Be gone! I think that was his only Pokemon. Ooh, levels are gained. Some flora flood the fl- Ah, oh, no, I messed up. <laughs> to be a waiter. To be a waiter is to wait. I'll wait for the perfect moment to take care of you. Jesus Christ, why did all these Tauros just charge at me? Sol the waiter, a better call Sol. <gasps> he has a Riolu. He has a ro 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 Riolu. I'm gonna destroy this Riolu. He <laughs> Alrighty. No, no, just wait just a moment. Wait, wait. All this waiting makes me anxious. What should I throw? The Pokeball. Pop quiz. What should I throw if I want to start a battle? Shade. You gotta throw that shade. Yo, she's a dragon tamer? That fits kind of sick. It's kind of cool. Like the outfit. Oh, I ain't got no more cross chops. I have been going hard, my dudes. I have been going hard. Alright. If you're starting to withdraw, then we just start seismic tossing. Solid 22 points of damage every single time. Thank you. Withdraw all you like. Withdraw all you like. Or for you, the fire crew. Did you know Team Star's fire crew has a base near here? I do, that's where I'm heading. Petra, how you doing? Are you, are you not looking to join, are you? This thing's a psychic type. 
Um, but I'm gonna smack down I'm on the floor. Smack down. Y'all need some more. Quick clop pop. Let's go. Nice damage. Quick clop pop. Damn it. I've been disarmed. Azumaru? Oh, that's a problem. Yeah, I'll switch on Azumaru. We got a Smolith. Mega Drain! Bounce? Oh boy. I might click it again, and I hope I live. I don't think I will. <gasps> we live in, baby. I did nothing. <laughs> ah, small live. You kind of suck, my friend. You kind of suck. Ah, uh, let's go to Fletchinder. I know it's fire type. I know. I know. I know. Oh, you knew I was going out of a fire type all of a sudden, did you? Alright, acrobatics. We should be faster. Do big damage, do big damage. Yes! Look at that. Small living Fido gaining levels. Muslim grassy terrain? Sure. Sure. Well, you're on fire. World's on fire. World's on fire. Oh, she doesn't say anything. My Pokemon and your Pokemon are so different about them. We'll find out what you got, Monica. Monica, you look like you need to go get some sleep, my girl. Your eyes are looking all kinds of, you know. All right, let's go into Small Live, Mega Drain. Should be a. Uh, Bada bing bada boom, you know what I'm saying? I'm saying. I think I always get this mixed up. I think Shellos is just pure water type, right? Then it becomes water growing. If I'm. Um, my head's in the right place. So we should be able to heal anything that he's gonna even throw at me, so. Which is nice, because Smolov gets a little bit of limelight. It's, it's been lacking, it really has, bless him. Oh, what? Is that a crit? Was that a crit? I did a lot. It wasn't. Alright, this needs to stop. You can't be recover stolen me, dude. I've spent three and a half hours on this episode so far. You can't be recover stalling me, my dude. I want to get to the team star base. Oh my god. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? This is why you don't get no sleep. Because you make battles last fucking 20 years. This is why you out of your eyes. you got massive bags under your eyes. Because you're doing strats like this. Get out of here. Be gone. Everything's different. I'll stick with it. What are you sticking with? I'll show you I'm tenacious and I'll stick it out no matter how hard the battle gets. Okay, good for you, my dude. Xavier. Okay, it's a Curlier. Might be a bit of a challenge. Um, let's see. Smackdown. All on the floor. Oh, he has three Pokemon. Quick Claw Pops. Let's go. 
Oh, that does not do a lot. And that does. And confused me. Okay, we're switching out. I don't really have anything for him, though. That's the problem. You know what? You know what? I think it's time for Crocolaw. I ain't seen him in a while. Eats them. Nom nom nom. Replies back with an incinerate. It's just because we don't really have the type ins for Ricolia, to be honest. Um, on the team at the moment. Wait, I didn't see which Pokemon's coming in. Ah, oh, I could have switched. I could have gone into Mankey. Uh, it's fine, but I would have rather have switched and shared the XP, but it's fine. That's what I get for spamming the A button. Yeah? What next? Let me make it gain level anyway. I didn't see it again! Alright, well... He's gonna resist this, but... It's still a two-shot. Wing attack. Not bad. Even though you've beat me, I still won't give up. Uh, what are you gonna do then? You gonna headbutt my Pokemon? <gasps> Nackly is evolving! Minecraft! Legit Minecraft! Roto to 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 Casopia Casopia here. I see you're getting close to one of the team star bases. I take it this means you've decided to join my operation. That's right. Thank you. With this you're officially a member of Operational Starfall. Hold on. Hold on a second. Who's that? Does this Operation Starfall of yours have room for one more member? Ah, who are you? <laughs> Name's Clyde. Oh, and how long have you been spying on us? No need to get your hackles raised. I'm a pal of your mutual friend here. Isn't that right, Jigsaw? We're not pals. Ah, uh, as shy as ever, I see. We're talking about going up against Team Star here. It's not something you can join for fun. I'm well aware. I just need to sort out some unsettled business with Team Star, that's all. Besides, I tend to get the job done well. Not that you can take my word for it, but it's true. I suppose I'm hardly in a position to refuse help. Welcome to the operative, Clive. Great, that settles it then. I think I heard your name earlier, Cassopia. Was it? Who exactly are you? Team Star and I share some history. That's all I'll say for now. I see. In that case, I won't pressure you any further. Good. Now, back to business. Let's talk Operation Starfall. Yes, what would you have us do? Simply put, I want you to raid each one of the Team Star bases. Then you'll defeat the bosses of each of the team and put an end to their rule. Put an end to their rule? You mean we need to oust these bosses from their rule somehow? That's right. Team Star is made up of five squads, and each one of those squads has its own base. You should be able to see the front gates of one of those bases now, in fact. Ah, yes. I can see them over there. On the other side of those is the base proper. And somewhere within the base lies one of the targets, a squad boss. Okay, I'm starting to get the idea. Well, that's just the outline. The key to the whole operation is the code that the team has to follow. If someone challenges one of the squad bosses to a battle, they have to, no choice but to accept. And what's more, if they just so happen to lose that battle, they must forfeit their role as a boss altogether. I went ahead and issued challenges to each base under your name, Jigsaw. They're basically declarations of war. Now all the team star knows that we're looking for a fight. So let's say we defeat all the bosses and they step down from their roles. What happens next? <laughs> the rest of the team crumbles with no one left to lead them. That's what happens. 
It's a solid pan, but not without wrinkles. Each base has a bunch of Pokemon inside to fend off intruders, and the base themselves are in considerable size. Your garden variety trainer wouldn't would be overrun long before they get anywhere near the boss. That's why your skills are essential to this operation, Jigsaw. Defeat the Pokemon inside the base and drag the boss out from where they're hiding. First things first, though, you need to deal with any grunts that might be guarding the front gates. And what will you be doing in the meantime? Like I said before, I have a history with Team Star. This means I can't operate in the open. I'll back you up from afar. Alright, what will my role be? Sorry, but I don't trust you completely yet. For now, I'd like you to monitor the base and act as Jigsaw's support. You're a cautious one, alright, I respect that. I'll be in touch again when the plan advances to the next stage. Good hunting out there. Well, go get them, Jigsaw. Director Clavel! Oh yeah! I have no idea what you mean, but if anyone asks you about me, remember this. I'm Clive, a normal academy student just like you. Nothing more, nothing less. <laughs> brilliant. Actually brilliant. We made it to the Team Star's base! Oh god. Oh god. Yes? Whoa, whoa, you can't be here. This place belongs to Team Star. If you don't clear out of here real quick, I'll have to come at you in self-defense. You get me? I'm not turning back. Alright, then. No time for me to defend the snot. Right here. Oh, Houndour. You are not going to like my lead. Knuckle stuck! Knuckle stuck. I literally could do anything I want. I should try that salt. Okay. I'm gonna try the salt or cure attack. I don't know what it does and I wanna know. Don't flinch me again, that's rude. Okay, salt cure. Oh, this music is fucking amazing! Quick clap up! Woo! I defended myself right, but it wasn't enough! I want to listen to more of that music. That music was. Fucking amazing. Man, you're crazy strong. Wait, are you that kid who declared war on Team Star? That's me. P-I-M-P. -P. Whoa, that's been terrible news. Cruise me while I book it back to the rest of my crew. Hasta la vista. Hey, Jigsaw. Professor Pia told me to scope out the fire crew's base. I thought I'd come and give you some backup now that I'm through. It seems you're all set. What? Is that you, Charcolos? I thought so. What are you doing here? You know, so this is Charles's card cadet. He's one of the Pokemon that the Academy takes care of within its grounds. Uh, Charlos, wait! Oh, he ran off. Looks like he may have some connection to the Team, team Fire Star blah, 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 crew. I'd better chase it after him. Don't worry, I'll regroup with you soon enough. You press ahead to the base, Jigsaw. Wee! to 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 Fuck's sake, this just doesn't end. I see you deal with the Grunt Standing Guard. Nice work. Stationed inside the base's th Team Star Fire's crew, the scheduler squad. Their yeah, boss, Mella, is the best all-rounder of the team. She fixes any and every problem thrown her way, though her methods are heavy-handed. A declaration of war must make her blood boil. I bet even now her grunts are harder work inside to the base trying to keep her fury under control. That means your best move is to take down all the grunts nice and quick. Once there's no one left to help Mella, keep her cool. She should come out to confront you. Ring the bell on the gates once you're ready to kick off this phase of the operation. Time to wipe the Skeeter's squad off the map. Shkeda. Okay, well, 
This is where we're going to go ahead and wrap up today's episode. I have recorded for 3 hours and 44 minutes to put this episode together. I don't know how long it's going to be. We caught a shit ton of Pokemon, explored loads of areas, and we've made it to a team star base. If you guys have enjoyed today's episode, please go ahead and like, comment, share, and subscribe. There's another one coming up in a couple of hours, so make sure you are, are indeed subscribed. I've been Jamie Jigsaw, and I'll see you guys next time.